All right, so in this problem, we have an expression and a few statements, and we have to choose the correct statement, the correct statement for this formula. So we have an expression, a linear expression right over here, and in order to better understand this expression, we are going to graph it. So first, let's label our axis. So we have A as our x-axis and B as our y-axis. Now, let's find two points, one where B or will, where A will equal 0, and one where b will equal zero. And then we will graph our two points and find our line. So when a equals zero, let's plug in a equals zero right over here. We have zero, oops, we have zero equals seven minus b. Now if we add b to both sides, we get b to equal seven. So when a equals zero, b will equal seven. And when b equals zero, let's plug in zero for b. We have a equals seven minus zero. Now, if we simplify, we have a equals 7. So when b equals 0, a will equal 7. And now let's graph our two points. Our first point will be 0 up 7. So we will be right over here. And our second point is 7 up 0. So we'll move across 7 and we'll move up 0. All right, so now if we connect our two, line, our two points, we have this linear function. All right. And now let's read our options and answers. If a is less than negative 7, b is positive. That means that if a is less than negative 7, b is always in the positive realm of the graph, which is correct. So a will be our correct answer, but let's figure out also why b, c, and d are incorrect. If a is greater than 7, b is positive. Well, if a is greater than 7, b is in the negative realm of the graph, which is incorrect. All right. Now let's move on to C. If B is greater than negative 7, B greater, negative 7 is right over here. Well, if B is greater than negative 7, A is positive. Now we see over here that if um, the B is greater than negative 7, A can be in the negative realm of the graph, and I mean in the negative realm of the graph over here, and also in the positive realm of the graph all of here. All right, so C is incorrect, and now let's read what D says. If B is less than negative 7 down here, then A is negative, which is also incorrect because we have, in this region, we have A to be positive when, when B is less than negative 7. So A can also be in the positive realm, therefore D is incorrect, and A will be our final answer.